YouTube, what up? It's been a minute, but we're back. Uh, I apologize for my lack of putting out videos. I've been slacking big time. Um, a lot of stuff's been going on in my personal life. I know I say that a lot, but seriously, a lot has been going on. Anyways, uh, I'm going to do my very best to start bringing you guys at least a couple videos a week. Good videos, informative videos, funny videos, whatever you want. But today, I've got a few different things I want to show you, and you've been asking for the food prep. So I figured, why not give you what you want? We're going to go to the grocery store, uh, show you what I pick up. I don't know how much filming I'll do in there, because... I remember a while ago, Remington kind of got in trouble for filming at Kroger's, which I think is really silly. But anyways, I'll take you with me, show you what I get, but I'll bring you guys along with me, show you what I get, like I said, and uh, maybe talk about a few things I kind of wanted to talk about as we're going through this process of cooking and cutting up all my food and et cetera, et cetera. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the video and let's go. Alright guys, in the car, and it's roughly like a, literally like a two minute drive to Kroger's, so we'll get there, and I don't know how much talking I'll actually do in the store, like I mentioned earlier, um, sometimes they're a little weird about that, so I might just kind of give you a glimpse of like my car as I get things, <laughs> but I'll do the best that I can with what I'm able to do, so we'll see you there. made it home from the hall um, I didn't get too much stuff you know just a couple things I actually have a lot of food in my house um, I will show you exactly what I bought I actually have a lot of meals already prepped but I figured since you guys wanted to see you know kind of what I get uh, how I cook it what I use etc etc I'd make a little small trip and get just a few things to give you kind of a relative idea of what I do eat um, and how I cook it so I will get this unpacked and we will go from there all right guys here we go got everything unpackaged um like I said I just got a few little things nothing too crazy because I actually have a lot of food already prepped in my fridge um first things first the carb master yogurts guys if you don't know now you know these things are absolutely amazing Check out those macros, one and a half grams of fat, two grams of sugar, five grams of carbs, nine grams of protein, and they are delicious. Try them out. Eggs, turkey burgers, I love them. A little bit of rice, nothing special. I actually need to break out my rice cooker and stop buying that stuff, but it just it's kind of spices it up a little bit, so I like to use it. Uh, some peppers and some chicken, and of course that lean beef. What is that, 92.8? I, I like to try and get like 
at least 90-10 when it comes to my beef. Just because one, I'm lazy and I don't want to drain the grease and two, uh, obviously the leaner the better. I don't need all that excess fat, etc, etc. No one really does. So that's why I like to stay with the lean stuff. So. Uh, I will get to cutting this stuff up, show you guys a little bit of it. Um, obviously, it's nothing special, but show you what I do, and we will get to cooking. There was a time when I was alone, nowhere to go and no place to call home. My only friend was the man in the moon, and even sometimes he would go away too. So basically with my chicken, uh, nothing crazy, I just cut it up into little pieces. I try not to keep them too thick, as you can see like they're pretty thin. That way it cooks all the way through, cooks evenly. Some non-stick coconut oil, because fitness. <laughs> Disclaimer, uh, the coconut oil spray would not make you fit. Just throwing that out there. <laughs> first batch down and cooking. I apologize for the lighting in here guys. I know it's not very good but you get the gist of what I'm doing. Um, we got a few seasonings up here. That sweet and smoky rub. Probably one of my favorites honestly especially for chicken. And also this one. For my ground turkey or ground beef. Love, love, love it. Every once in a while we are even throwing a little Cajun I don't do anything crazy. Uh, I actually have the low, I think it's low sugar ketchup or something that I use on my stuff. And I also use uh, this barbecue sauce, which I'll show you in a little bit because one of these meals is actually going to be my dinner. Um, so I'll show you that when the time comes. You stay the closer you watch your roots, that's the reason I know. I can teach you how to hit the skies, rise above them without getting high. But if it help a bit, take a little hit, take a little sip. Put your mind at ease where you got the keys. You can have your dreams. That's up to you, not what others believe. Jeez. I swear that's the part that Alright guys, so we got our peppers chopped up. We're just gonna I guess you could say saute them up. Is that the correct term? <laughs> uh, get, just get them cooked up. And then uh, after my chicken's cooked, we'll just add it to that. Maybe throw some rice in there. Um, and I believe, oh, I forgot my veggies. Failure. Um, most of the time I get like frozen veggies, just a mixed bag. You throw them in the microwave for like five minutes and then I just kind of portion it out like as I want, you know, probably like half one meal, half for another meal. So it takes a little bit of it, but I'm kind of lazy when it comes to cooking or I just cook a lot. So therefore, uh, the quickest, easiest way is normally the route that I go. Recently, some of you may know this or you might've actually seen a little glimpse of it in the video already, but uh, yesterday, which today's Sunday, so Saturday night, um, the wife and I decided to go get tattoos. She actually has some already, but this is my first ever one. Um, I might as well show it now. It is our wedding date, which I know some of you be like, oh, that's corny, blah, blah, blah. But uh, I actually really like it a lot. So, and it was my very first tattoo. Um, she got some footage of that on my phone. So I'm going to try to like put that on here and just show you like what happened and all that stuff. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. And when we're bored, we play in the woods, always on the run from Captain Hood. Never gotta be alone. I found company inside a song. Take it off your chest, throw it in a poem. If they try to flex, show them where you going. Hating on your past, kill them with your moment. When you get the chance, drop it like you stole it. She said, I don't wanna grow up. I gotta go keep my passions alive. Please say you've heard of a place I can fly where nothing's impossible. That's where I gotta go. They said 
And we're back. Um, I hope you guys enjoy that. I didn't want to put like too much in here. Most of you probably know basically what a tattoo is, what goes into it, but I thought it was kind of cool considering it was my first one. Uh, I won't lie, it did hurt a little bit. Like the top part of it where you're the bone up there, uh, that hurt. But other than that, it really wasn't too bad. I know some of you guys are laughing at me like, good, good, good. They're saying that hurt. Uh, I've heard it before. But anyways, like I said, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, one more thing while we're waiting for all this food to cook. Chicken's still going. Uh, round two, actually, of the chicken. Um, check out this bracelet I got here. It's got that little crown on it. And then also... This one as well, let me take it into the light. Live Lift on it. Super nice, I cut my hand the other day, I don't know. Super nice bracelets. Um, check them out on tonysshopspot.com. I will give you, I'll put all the information in the description box. Um, and use code NATE20. It'll save you 20% until Thursday at 5 p.m. Central Time. Um, take advantage of it, I promise you they're really nice. I wouldn't recommend it unless I stood behind a product, kind of like Remington does. If you guys ever watch his videos, he says the same thing. Um, but it, take advantage of the sale and get you something nice, get your lady something nice. You know, I mean, either way, it's a win-win. And 20% off, you can't beat that. All right, guys, first batch of chicken is done. Let's throw that away. Peppers, the chicken. So we got our scale out. Uh, yes, in the off season, I do weigh my food. Uh, reason being, I try to make sure that I'm getting enough food in, but I fail to do that quite often. If we're being honest, I fall short of calories um, a lot. But when I'm able to, I still do what I can to make sure I'm at least getting in what I need for that meal, if that makes any sense. Um, you know, the rest, what I eat throughout my day, if it's something I'm not able to weigh or whatever, and I need to figure out the macros or, you know, the calories to kind of get an idea for where I'm at for the day, I'll just throw it in my fitness pal. Or, my coach actually turned me on to this new app. I have a lot on there, but um, that one right there, Fat Secret, um, it's awesome. And it's super simple to use. It's got literally everything on it. So if you, I mean, my fitness pal works as well. Believe it or not, I actually like that one a little bit better. It's a lot easier to use, and like I said, it has more stuff on it. So therefore, I just go with that. But let's get this food weighed. I'll show you. I roughly stick between like eight to nine ounces of meat. Um, then with my veggies and greens, I kind of, you know, just throw them in there. I don't really weigh that stuff out at all. But I'll show you guys what I do. Down there. Get it zeroed out. Grab my chicken. And voila, 8.8 .8 ounces of food. Nothing crazy, actually pretty simple, but that's how I do. But I'm gonna keep cooking and I will check in with you guys in a little bit. All right guys, all of our chickens cooked up. It's got to add the veggies and the peppers to some meals, but basically you get the point. Now it's time for the ground beef. Just like that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are done. Um, basically all I need to do is go get some veggies and add that to it. Mixed veggies, got like some broccoli, uh, like the mini corn, maybe some potatoes. Just a little stuff to add to some, add some carbs to your meals. And this is what kind of like my leftover meal, but what I'm going to be eating tonight. Uh, roughly like four ounces of lean ground beef and eight ounces, eight and a half ounces of uh, chicken. I'm also going to cook some rice. Decisions, decisions. Probably the garden veggie. Yeah, I like this one a lot. I'll cook that. Um, it equals out to, there's two cups, yeah two cups in there so I'll probably put a cup in here and then a cup in one of these other meals maybe for tomorrow or something um, like I said I keep my meal preps fairly simple uh, it's not that, that I don't enjoy cooking it's just that I'm gonna do it I want to do it the quickest simplest way so therefore this is what I have found to be the easiest way for me I've tried the crock pot thing and all that um, and I might go back to that from time to time 
because I mean it's that's really simple you just put it in leave it for you know 10 hours come back and it's done but for now I just decided to fry it up and show you guys what I do um, I really hope you enjoyed and I hope that it was somewhat informational to you I don't really know exactly uh, what else to throw in this to help but I figured as long as I stick to the basics you guys will let me know and of course I can always do another video all right all right well I'm going to get to eat eating uh, here's the ketchup I was telling you guys about reduced sugar I need to get some more this stuff's actually really really good and JB's best barbecue sauce the macros and I mean they're okay if that'll focus there we go not too bad a little bit of carbs in there uh, but honestly as long as you use it sparingly it's really not too bad then of course my aminos to wash it down gotta love them uh, make sure you use code Nate 10 get you that percentage off and help your boy out but I'm gonna get this eight and I will check in with you guys in a minute all right guys well just finished up my meal uh, my wife and her daughter on their way to the house so I'm gonna finish up this video and enjoy some family time uh, once again I hope you guys enjoyed make sure you take advantage of all the sales that I said mentioned in this video I'll leave all the information in the description box um, if you guys need any help with weight loss maybe trying to gain some muscle don't know where to start or you're ready to mix it up hit me up I will leave my email also in the description and I'll be happy to work with you guys with that being said I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one